Music Monday, it is that, and today it's all about Detroit. It's about our singers, musicians, writers, and a whole lot more. That's because this Friday night at the Fillmore, the 26th annual, 26, hard to believe, uh, Detroit Music Awards will be handed out. Joining me now, one of the co-founders of this event, Gary Graff. It's great to have Good you morning. back on the Thanks show. For Good morning. Us again. Nice to see you. Yeah, sure. It's the 26th annual award. Well, we're calling it the first year of the next 25. <laughs> okay, good. How are things going? I mean, things are going well. Yeah. We're, uh, there's still some tickets available, but we're very happy yeah. with, uh, with everything that's going on. We have a, we have a great lineup. Yeah. And, and what does that mean? Go ahead, drop some A, a great on. lineup. Well, we have uh, the group we're, we're going to hear sure. shortly, the Theater Bazaar Orchestra, we're very excited about. Uh, the Fags uh, making kind of a rare appearance, and they did a bunch of covers of iconic Detroit songs by Madonna, Ted Nugent, the Romantics, in their own way. Okay. So we're going to have that as part of the show. Royce the Five Nine, who's also receiving the Spirit of Detroit Entertainment Award. It's a mouthful. He's performing with a VMDP, the KDJ Trio, which is part of the Sphinx organization, a okay. classical group. They're getting a Distinguished Achievement Award for the Grandy Ballroom crowd, Third Power, and SRC uh, together. Also getting a distinguished so something for everybody. Award. Something really, there is. For there's a, there's just a ton of there'll be a ton of performances, ton of awards on stage, tears. And how does tears. this work? How do the DMAs work in terms of the voting process? Uh, check addressed to me. It's not um, <laughs> a little payola. It is a. Yeah. It's patterned after the Grammy Awards. It's a three phase uh, system. Okay. Where where you, they're submitted, nominated, and then a final ballot. The people are voted for. It's all professional voting body. Uh, musicians, talent buyers, club owners, okay. media, media people. And, and you said this, tickets are available, so anybody can available. attend? Anybody can attend. What a great night, huh? It is, and it's a, it's a real chance, Chuck, to see classical musicians talking to rappers and jazz guys talking to country people, and it's the one night yeah. a year our music community gets to be under the same roof together. And you're holding an album from holding, the group yes. here, but this is important because we're seeing, uh, not just this year, but a resurgence in vinyl and in turntables. Vinyl, yeah. So that's got to well, be We have good. a vinyl pressing plant in town now. Right. Another vinyl pressing plant, we should say, which is really exciting. But uh, yeah. Theater Bazaar Orchestra, who's going to be kicking off the show um, after a little special surprise we have planned. Oh. Uh, involving, I'll just say bagpipes. And we'll, we'll leave it at that. Okay. But uh, these guys are great. And they're not only are they performing at the Music Awards on Friday, they're going to be at Otis Supply in Ferndale on May 9th, on okay. the following Tuesday. Beautiful. So you have two chances to catch them. Well, it's great to see you as always. Good to see you. Congrats Thank on you again. getting into your next 25. Thank you. Good stuff, Gary Graff. Again, it's uh, the Detroit Music Awards this Friday night. It's at the Fillmore Detroit. Tickets are $25, and you heard Gary say it. There's still tickets available. Why don't we hear now from one of the featured performers that are nominated, the Theater Bazaar Orchestra. One, two, cannonball! Thank you. 